but isn't isn't currently it is not i think <laughs> if you if you tried to play spectrum and long war 2 at the same time i think i think i think things would not go so well in general terrible name i haven't seen any of the money that you're giving me yet they have to you have to get at least 100 bits before they'll send you any of it. I'm not a proud man. Thank you, Rootful, for the 5 bits. I don't know if I should acknowledge that you guys are giving me the donations of under, like... I don't know. Where's Where's my personal price? I have to decide. I guess I acknowledge when you guys send me messages for free. Yeah, fair enough. This pod seems a lot weaker than the other pods I've been fighting. Oh, are those the fancy dragon round guys, though? Maybe they're the fancy dragon round guys. Prometheus Master Sergeant. Throw incendiary grenade. That sounds unpleasant. Immune to fire. Also other things, but fire is the only one that's relevant because I just got dragon rounds. Rolling. Oh, it goes. Rolling out. I think 404 bits should just make my stream crash every time someone donates that much. Yeah, I, I do know that my green screen gets a little bit weird sometimes, Revo. It's like a little bit weird right now. It's a very... Very awkward place to try to run a green screen because there's a lot of natural light coming in through windows onto it, which means that the shade of the green is changing over the course of a day. But I could tweak it a little bit, and it would be working better right now. Oh no, I'm slowly, I'm slowly, slowly losing my physical form. That's not good. Maybe over the course of a stream, I should just uh, slowly but surely fade away into nothingness. Every day. Maybe I just need more lights than I have. Don't sleep with my mother in the past, or this is what happens. Verstanden. Rück aus. But I like this. Feindliche Gruppe entdeckt. Pretty sure I don't like sleeping with my mother in the past. Ooh, image. We found an image. I wonder if my game is about to crash. That does not seem like a good thing. have to get everybody there 11 turns from now, so probably like next still turn, which I think... Did my game just die? <laughs> Are we live still? Holy they fuck. Well, we're still streaming, but we you. might not be a live. Target identity confirmed. I'm always looking for better ways to troll you guys, you know. That sounds like a pretty good one. So did this pod pull? They like are invisible or something? There's still an image right here. I wonder if it's gonna kill me.
What sort of attacks do images use? To run and gun. It just doesn't seem super strong here. Wait, your turn is over? Ooh, this this is not this is not how you play XCOM well. No, no, this is not how you play XCOM well, Steven. Uh Silly Steven. What do you think happens if I shoot the image? Ooh, we can go for a skull mine. And it's actually like pretty good here. Especially if I ever hit with it in my entire life. Hey, I dealt two damage. Hey, I... What? Why can you move? That's... What? <laughs> my life is so confusing. Is that an okay place to stand? Line of sight's broken. Wait, did you die? I just can't see him on the tile he's on, I think. Hey, Magopus, how you doing? Turn on cereal. It's unlikely to do a lot here, but it might do something. Gets me that kill for free. Does something good? No. I'm not a pro. <sighs> oh, I'm not allowed to use a running gun. So actually, turning Serial on was just terrible. Out. I'm sorry to hear it, Sir Wagglepuss. <laughs> I assure you that Spectrum shenanigans are already in progress. Come on, focus. Do you guys remember how enjoyable it was to watch Gate Crash Air when I played Gate Crash in Spectrum? Just asking for a friend. The way that environmental damage works just in vanilla XCOM 2 is very weird and un like unintuitive, difficult to work out sort of stuff. So yeah. There are basically environment objects which have 5 hit points, 10 hit points, 20 hit points, and there's like some other stuff, but that's almost everything in the game. 
and then you either destroy the environment outright or you do nothing to it. So like if a frag grenade's dealing eight environmental damage or 13 environmental damage or something, it's going to completely obliterate one set of the environmental objects in the game and do nothing to another set. And there is no way for you as the player to actually identify like which is which. You just get to uh, find out whether your action was, you know, completely wasted or not. Whatever you say. As I grow closer to That's image, my game seems more and more confused. So we've got another gazillion guys. That might not be great for us. Why did I make that move? I guess there are some nice flanks that I got. In close. I don't know exactly what's going on, Revo. Actually, in Long War, you can consistently destroy stuff with 5 of envir environmental HP, and our grenades deal damage like near 10 with some fall off, so there's like a range of how successful you are against stuff with 10 HP. That's sort of the middling amount that could be targeted to actually make the system sort of interesting. But yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna pretend that I love the way that grenades work in any iteration of XCOM 2. What if the image is a metaphor for something, maybe? Light cover isn't really cover in this game. So... I have Implacable, so we can... Kill the Master Sergeant and then move back. Sounds pretty good. could have used that guy dying like a lot go for one crit here I'm gonna choose to believe You need if there was a check when targeting that would only highlight an object if it had less hit well, points than the grenade that? had environmental damage um, there's randomization how much damage the uh, grenade does, though, so that it doesn't always do exactly the same thing. So a check like that's going to lie to you some of the time. No problem, boss. You could create some sort of like very complicated interface, which tried to like display the percent chance of destroying a cover object or something, but it like isn't a clean system so it's hard to come up with a clean interface to support it going in for the kill location confirmed can you just say that he's flanked here Huh. I just crashed to desktop. Uh, we might have to console through this mission or something. I tried to aim at the uh, image and it didn't work very well. <laughs> I 
The image is apparently an infiltrator sent to undermine my campaign. I don't know that you really can have have all three of non-tile snapping grenades, grenade fall off, and grenades not doing randomized damage. Because I think you have really, really, really exacerbated pixel hunting stuff if you do all three of those things, terrible name. And also like the system like the ui still isn't going to be good like different environmental objects destruct in different ways and stuff so there is no clear thing you can communicate by highlighting an environmental object it's just a mess I'm not a proud man What happened? I feel like my game's running very nicely now. I moved forward and pulled another pod. Did we already pull the pod? Should we do everything exactly the same as we did last time and see if the game crashes again? That could be a good use of five minutes of our time. I have XCOM installed on a solid state drive, so all of the loading runs pretty quickly. I highly recommend if you have a solid state drive. Like a lot of people just use solid state drives for like windows and Oh this time the pink car is on the poster, but he still missed. That time he just shot out the wall though. I think he's just an angry man, honestly. Anyway, um I highly recommend putting XCOM 2 on your solid state drive if you have one. Why did you shoot with that gun? Oh. Okay. I guess all bets are off at this point, because, like, clearly. Clearly, the game's not going to play out the same way now that I have made a ridiculous different move. a sexy thing to do. I'm just going to assume that somebody else can kill this guy. Good riddance. Don't have implacable there. We do have implacable here. But we might not kill. Don't have running gun on you. Everything's so complicated. That sets you on fire, so that's probably not a good move. God. They ask so much of me. about a 75% chance to kill. If it didn't, I mean, <laughs> we're already in a very messy situation. So, 
yeah. If it didn't, we'd still be in a very messy situation. I think that has a billion hit points, 16 and 4 armor. I think we can put him here and feel okay about it. Don't have lightning hands, but I do have running gun. For some extra damage with Hunter's Instinct Sprocking, so that's another two on this shot. And then the rifle should finish that off. Unless we get very unlucky. Jakira has about infinity hit points. I'm going to put him here in Overwatch. Let's put Nicoletta here. Seems doable. Hope our soldiers aren't on fire too much next turn. I don't actually remember what fire does in vanilla XCOM. Some damage, but you're still allowed to shoot, I think. Can I use suppression on the image? That sounds like just generally not a great idea. Just uh, not something I'm eager to try right now. I wonder if my game is just uh, just done. That's quite beautiful right there. Quite beautiful. What do you think that is? It's like if drug users meant balloons made for children. In the Neolithic era. That's my read. Any interpretation of art is valid. So that's probably, that's probably really what it is. Uh, the AI seems to be breaking because presumably of the image. So the image was perhaps on our side all along. Looks like a melted computer component. Maybe it's like a Rorsarch test. Is that how you pronounce that word? I have no idea how to pronounce that. But like the older I get, the more I just believe in my ability to confidently say something wrong and nobody will call me on it. Oh, this is not what I should have done. Because now I'm only removing his cover in this direction. If I had demolition from over here, I could have got them both, probably. Maybe not? I don't know. I guess that this probably works anyway, because I do have soldiers out on that flank. Also, like, he's going to pass his turn if he gets a turn anyway, so <laughs> it's all moot in the end, I guess. Rorschach. I believe you. Could be something on this one. Get clear. There was some good force behind that shot. Text to speech. We are exalt. 
We have hacked your systems and taken control of the review. That's interesting. Uh, um, apparently, that's not something I'm planning for the upcoming Beagle review, but I think like several months ago, I was thinking about what I'd do for Exalt and tried text-to-speech and this website remembers it. Uh, okay. Rorschach. I don't know how to spell it either. Rorschach. Hey. Rorschach. Should we listen to it in... Rorschach. Ooh. That was from Indonesia. Rorschach. <laughs> Very good. Uh, Brad just talking to me. I should, I should go. I should go. Sorry, text to speech website. Status confirmed. Target package in custody. I got you. Shoot at the image. Nothing bad could happen. Wait, the image is gone. Oh, there. Let's do this. Negative damage. Now Pro Axel's on fire. Thanks a lot for that. Uh, Spartacus, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. All right. Order's confirmed. Moving out. Clearly, this man must be stopped. I think we killed it. We have taken our revenge. I was literally fighting a computer glitch, yeah. Okay, I'll go. I'm going. Some sort of bad config or something defining that enemy led to it not it making it all the way into the game. Ooh, I gained two health and the then I burned for two health as well. Menace one five, we're picking up an enemy transport inbound on your current position. So I'm on fire, which means I can't use most abilities, but I can shoot. Heading there now. We're green to go. Headed there now. Ich bin bereit. Uh, I guess that'll be okay. I see the carry animation broke again. Yes, it did help me quite a lot, Rebet. That's 100% true. 
What am I gonna do about it though? So I can't Overwatch. Heading to that location. Apparently I can't Overwatch. I don't think they would have done that much. They might have wounded a couple of soldiers, but I took like a fairly significant wound on Pro Axel to bring down the image anyway. So I think it all balances out in the end. Like being able to see outside there's no reason that there has to be natural light coming into this room other than like that it makes my life generally more pleasant to live did the other guy die i wasn't Playing with my green screen. I think he's dead. I just assume that he's dead. Copy that. Bewegung, bewegung. Got it. Solid copy. Oh, beast. I don't know. You are asking the hard questions, though, and I appreciate that. My game, honestly, might just crash at the end of this mission as it tries to clean it up. That was an interesting interpretation of the command I was giving there. Working. 
Hey, is my game dead? No. <laughs> the computer does exactly what you tell him to do, which is not always what you want him to do. Yes, Robo Jumper. Sometimes, sometimes computers are a little bit too precise with their execution of your commands. Operation Steel King didn't seem to be too bad. Maybe that was the Steel King. He was like under the ground with his steel friends. But then I killed him, which makes me the new Steel King. Oh yeah. Our troops are making it look easy out there, Commander. Woo. All thanks to you. You and your crew have dealt another serious blow to the aliens' efforts. <laughs> Impressive work. Sounds like you're having a good day, Robo Jumper. That takes a really long time to uh, reinstall, too. I was amazed at how much stuff is in the XCOM SDK. Smurf is linking snake porn in my chat again. Smurf. Be meaning to talk to you about that. We can get you help, Smurf. If you need help, we can get that for you. I don't think I need a seventh engineer. Just keep on going toward this next facility, I guess. Ooh, we're going this way around the world now. That's exciting. Because the world is a sphere. But you can't go this way. But it, you know. <laughs> Long live the resistance. Have another radio relay. Let's contact New Indonesia. Commander, we've utilized all of our available communications capacity. We can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our systems. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Got an urgent communication coming. How do we do, Shadow Man? We had high hopes for the resistance. We had high hopes. Commander, and you have outdone yourself. <gasps> I've outdone myself. I don't like his feedback. Seems completely random to me. He's given me three different grades for basically identical performances, as far as I can tell. Major breakthrough. Oh boy. Next retaliation strike is imminent. We have 631 supply to pick up at some point. Commander, if we want to set back the aliens' work on the Avatar project, we should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. I'm on it, Bradford. I got this. I do not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Okay, so now we have the alloy rifles, which can deal a billion damage to things which don't have armor. And we also have the... I don't even remember what they're called. The... No... No. No. Ah, the disruptor rifles. We have the disruptor rifles, which can shred armor really well for us. So I'm pretty happy with that. I feel like that's 
good to end the campaign on. The only thing which might be nice to upgrade would be the heavy weapons that we're using for gunners. And since these are so cheap Illyrium wise, looks like we can do that. Do we want alloys? Do we have a choice? Because we don't have any Illyrium, like I just said. I was not going to admit it to Shin, but there is one thing I miss more than my lab equipment. Those damn juicy Advent burgers. I don't know where they get the meat. And frankly, I do not want to know. Hey, Commander. <laughs> You're a weird guy, Tygen. Um, so right now I could build... I could go up to four rifles, plus the... I guess we only want three. Plus I have one disruptor rifle. Mostly I just want disruptor pistols, but those cost infinity Illyrium. So we'll stay on plasma pistols for the most part right now. I don't believe I want an alloy pistol on anyone. It's fine to just use rifles for that, probably. Maybe. Build one alloy pistol, too. And then research-wise, I think I'll just go to the next tier of armor. recovered from the field. The alloy used in their frames is significantly lighter, making them more suited to the human form. I'm guessing it's the same material we've seen them using all over the colonies, but they'd have to be... I am ready to begin on your order, Commander. Is the mid and late game becoming too easy? I don't know, because, I mean, I haven't, like, lost anyone for a little while. I think that when I reinforcement farmed 100 enemies on the Avenger defense. Like, everything has been pretty easy from then, which makes perfect sense. Because getting a ton of free level ups should make the game pretty easy. And I maybe just be able to ride that to a pretty easy campaign one. But we'll see what happens. I don't know what enemies are in store for me. Gildong Nani Namja wants to be using one of these coil rifles. Alloy rifles. Oh yeah, that's pretty. He's dealing 11 to 13. It's a 15% crit chance and an extra 6 damage on crit. Has minus three armor pierce though, so it's very poor to shoot at armored enemies. Um, an advanced auto loader looks pretty good on his gun. I don't know that we need laser sights on this so much. It seems like something that's more relevant. Um, more relevant on the ones that are shooting at enemies with armor because they will need crits to deal good damage. Drake540, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Enjoy the show. I do appreciate the support, Drake. Welcome to the Advent Skynet. See you, Walrus. Should build grapple guns so my soldiers get even more free moves. I've thought about it. It just feels like. Plate plus ammo is what I want my equipment to be for the most part, though. So somebody is going to end up still having a plasma rifle. I will bring Larian for a Skulljack. She actually hits one of those sometime soon. I think it will be pretty good.
Maybe stocks on the cannons when I get them? I don't know. I don't know exactly what's going on with these weapon mods, but this this team should be really, really strong. We have the pistols to remove all of the armor, and we get to shoot them lots of times, so they're not dealing a lot of shred, but they'll end up dealing plenty. And then the alloy rifles to kill the unarmored targets. A couple of plasma rifles, one heavy cannon. We have one, two frag, somebody with skull mining, a med kit. I'm going to bring a flashbang instead of a smoke. Is the counter to a codex. Press go. Sky Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. Unequip the dragon rounds and analyze them. Can I like build more of them that way? Huh. I did triumph against the image, you know. I was able to kill it. It shot me though. And set my guy on fire. What am I enabling?